Good afternoon. I did a video a little earlier where I was firing the Defender 2 in the 357 uh, into this computer that's a picture here. It's this Dell. And uh, there's one spot where two rounds hit real close together and just about pierce through. The uh, sheet metal on the Dell is pretty thick. And I thought this would be a good opportunity to try the just about the same slug, something just a hair larger. It's the 125 grain uh, against the same kind of sheet metal. So what I'm going to do is spin this thing around get to the other side and see what the 357 does. Now, uh, what I'm probably going to do is go ahead and uh, fire two magazines, 16 rounds into it. And then uh, in the next video I do on this, which will probably be tomorrow, I'll probably rip the computer apart to see just what kind of damage was done on the inside. So with that said, <coughs> safety still works. <laughs> Wow, eight goes really fast. <laughs> okay, so if you saw the other video, you know there's a significant difference between uh, this one and a Defender. Still with the 357. Okay, that never gets old. <laughs> okay, let's see if I can do this without turning the camera off. That is a wicked hole. And some people wonder how to uh, clear a hard drive professionally so that the data can't be restored. If you can see inside there's a hard drive, I think that may be the way to do it. All you need to get is a BWS uh, 35 and 357. None of them exited, but uh, I'm here to tell you that's some pretty good damage. So if you're curious about what a Defender 357 does versus what the uh, BWS 45 and 357 does, that's your answer. That's BWS 45 and 357, and that is the Defender in 357. So I hope, I hope you all have a good day. Take care. Bye-bye.